Welcome to Squad Ops. I'm Killer Man Time, and I'm joined by Wolfgang, and today we are spectating and commentating on Operation Fishhook. Hope y'all are having a fantastic day. Gonna go ahead and get straight into it. We're gonna go over the uh, commands for tonight. For the Russian side, we have Rubba for as command, his two IC being Lawn Darts, his three SLs being Raggy, Wilbur, and Dixfolk. Uh, how about over there on the militia side? Uh, over on militia, we got Revy commanding with uh, Fulcrum as two IC, and he's got Koopa, Oddball, and Jenkins under his command. All righty then. And we're going to go over the loadouts for tonight for the russians they are for infantry squad level one sl two ftls two ars one lat one medic uh for platoon level they have two mgs two riflemen as ammo bearers don't let that uh icon on the stream uh confuse you it is riflemen and crewmen as needed now there is a new grouping uh the what is it? The counterintelligence. Uh, they will be made up of four pilots and or four recruit kits. Uh, for vehicles for the Russian side, we're looking at one BTR-80 and two transport trucks. FOB and logistics, nothing for FOBs, but for logistics, they have command support, two artillery smoke barrages. How about over here on the militia side? Uh, overall militia, we're rocking an SL, two FTLs, two ARs, and a medic for the squad. The platoon armory is coming with four scouts slash sappers, whichever they want, and then eight lats to deal with the BTRs, six MGs, and two riflemen with ammo. The VIX, we got two dish technicals and two transport tucks. No logistics on this side. All right. This is going to be a pretty uh, straightforward battle. No, no bombs, nothing, Just, well, except for the smoke grenade or smoke mortars, artillery. Mind, work with me. All right, so we're going to move over to the op map. It's a little tiny. I should have blown it up a bit. Um, so the counterintelligence for the Russians will be starting down there at the bottom uh, right-hand corner where the Russian main would usually be. Um, and their objective is to be escorted. Yeah. Wolfgang, help me out here. Where is the Russian forces starting at? Other than the CIT? Or is the it... The Russian for They're starting across the river. And they should be just about Neva Upper. Okay. So, yeah, they're going to have to try to get across that river to save their guys. Okay, yeah, I see it here. They uh, they start at Bravo 9-8 on the uh, grid square. Um, and the CITs start in, can start in either Lima 12, Lima 13, or Kilo 13. Um, got some command lines. Sorry if I stutter a bit. Aside from that, that's pretty much the beginnings for the Russians. Oh, no, they just changed something. Okay, updating Whoa. for the Russian loadout. Uh, for the platoon level, it's not uh, MGs. It is ARs now. Just to keep everyone updated. Uh, how about for the um, militia side? What's their objective? So the militia's main objective is just to eliminate that counterintelligence team. In the meantime, though, they have to deal with the rest of the Russian platoon coming after them. All right. And rulings for tonight. There is no crossing of the river unless you're crossing over a bridge, vehicle, or infantry on either team. Bridges must be used. All right. We will we'll bring y'all straight. Clay knows what he's doing. All right, guys. Put your binos down. Stop fidgeting and listen up. We are the Russians. We have an intel team to secure. What we are going to do is we are going to push Raggy's element and Dick's folks element up into the north towards the squad four move mark right here. You guys are going to be securing the area across the bridge and providing fire to get the militia off of that ground. Eventually you'll push in via these marks here. 
I can't see him. Indio, come and join us. You can't see my POS? Okay, darn. Um, okay, Gotta helmet the marks mark. this then. Okay, dang. Yep. You guys will push in via these helmet marks eventually after initially securing the location here on these skull marks. If you are on the south with Wilbur and Lawn Darts, we will be coming in like so. I'm doing this the wrong way again. You'll be coming in like so. Down across this bridge and down to the south. Hopefully we'll be able to rendezvous with the uh, friendly Intel team in India 11 while the northern element screens us. From there, we will all bound back and get to the Foxtrot 7 objective area. That is our goal. We're trying to get there with the CIT team. If that does not happen, the CIT. If the CIT, for some reason, dies and we're not across the west side of the river yet, we're going to go to Solaninki and hold it against enemy forces until they're all dead. If we're across the river and the CIT manages to die, we're going to go back up to the bunker and hold it and kill all the militiamen. Any questions? Just what are the rules of engagement, thing? Command? Okay, foo, rules of engagement. Your ROE, if you are on the north, is report it first to your squad leaders and then get clearance to engage. If you're on the south, try to keep weapons tight, but there are certain situations where you're not going to be able to. If you're taking fire, if you're in exposed ground, etc., we may need to change that. The idea is that the southern team will sneak in, engage the enemy, secure the CIT, and withdraw with the northern two squads covering. Any other questions? Understood. So I was just going to add, there's a big old mean piranhas and big meaty sharks in the rivers, so we can't go in there. We have to use This the is absolutely true. You do have to use bridges. There are, as Scottish has said, a lot of piranhas. Perhaps a few bull sharks. Just be aware of that. Watch out. Don't go into the water, please. Okay. Any other questions? All right, no further questions. Squad leaders, break them out. We have about three minutes to live. A particularly the hard worker, is, you know, somewhere by the His 9 name 10 line, maybe Boogie. dismount there. Boogie, can you please stand uh, up? I, I, I want to play it safe at the beginning. But then after that, we're just basically going to sweep south. Okay. Uh, we have a next. traitor. Uh, Kuba's going to kind of He's get on the flank a little bit weapons to try and tell him if he can. Uh, on the enemy, three and four, you're going to have to watch for potential... Uh, reinforcements to so just keep the 360 up, but in general, uh, we're going to maintain oh, a priority to uh, uh, locate the whole team. Okay, hey, ready? I'll take care of that. Leave them, leave them, leave them in the dirt. Is anybody else getting like double okay. on a uh, Jenkins or whatever? Yeah, we're getting double the revy, okay. but now it's over. The traitor is dead. Okay, everyone else. We, we have to recover the intelligence that he gave away before it falls back into Russian hands. We've discovered uh, the Russians who he's delivered the intelligence to, they're not far south from here, and they're trying to escape back across the river, going to Neva Upper. So what we're going to do, uh, once HQ sets us free, uh, we're going to move south in a platoon line, and we're going to surround the enemy CIT team and eliminate them before they're able to escape. The way we're going to do this, uh, Jenkins, you're going to move out on foot uh, southeast into the woods, marked by the five mark. Um, oh, I don't think you can see those. You can see the five mark. Can you not? No one no. can see the five no. mark. The peasants no, can't see No, we cannot. Nope. Okay. Now we can see. The helmet mark. We got it. Jenkins is going to move on foot to the helmet mark. Fulcrum, he's going to have yeah, two dish techies. He's going to be patrolling down the road. Uh, he's going to have a fire team along the road uh, on the fob mark with his dishkas in the field uh, to the west. Oddball is going to take one of the transport trucks. He's going to take him to the farm, marked by the helicopter mark, uh, dismount somewhere there, maybe a little bit further south, and proceed south. Kuba is going to go on the far flank and uh, screen the west side of the platoon, uh, the platoon line and continue south. Uh, see, we're going to drop Kuba off probably somewhere around the BTR mark. Basically, 
that's going to give us enough spacing for all the squads to get a good platoon line. We're going to be moving south, searching for the enemy CIT team. And um, the one thing that we have to remember is that Russia mains down there, so we kind of have to go around that. We can't push too far into that. But other than that, uh, let's keep a good formation as we go. Listen to your squad leads. Uh, work with your fire team leads. And if we fail to capture the, the uh, CIT team, uh, we're going to move to the bridgehead that I'm marking with the IED mark. We're going to stage up there. Uh, we're going to form a base of fire and then cross uh, squads across the river with fire support. Sound good, guys? Yes. Sounds good. I mean, I guess. Well, I'm okay. okay. Is that a cricket in your background, Ruby? <laughs> you guys can hear him? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I, I, it's my pet. It's my pet cricket. Okay. He wasn't What's impressed by the speech. I thought it was ambient, like, in the game. Uh, yeah, I think it's me. the ambient noise as well. I just okay. thought you lived in the bayou or something. The it's bayou of Canada? Jimmy. I thought someone was just trolling the commander. It, it, it's, what, it's what I listen to. <laughs> it's, it's my background. There's actually one something there. actually Anyways, okay, we got a couple minutes. Squad leads, break them out. I mean, I had chlamydia before. I, I would prefer that contact be had in the north first. PM However, we do need to cross south at some point and recover. And we are land. live. So south is a guaranteed crossing. As north the ghost of Boogie has let us know. Looks like he just keeps giving out intel. That doesn't necessarily mean you have to push into them, but you are trying to engage. <laughs> he never learns. I forget, is it him or is it Dwarf that has issues with grenades and windows? Oh, that. Well, it could go both ways, but it's more boogie. More okay. boogie. I guess it's a good thing then. However, it is the team kills that come from boogie. Yeah, that's a very good point. Also, stumps cannot be driven over. One trans trucky has, or trans truck has learned that the hard way. Very last thing, because I almost forgot. If I happen to die, Londar to two I C. Next is Wilbur. Next is Raggy. Next is Dick. Dick. So it will be one, three, two, four. Seems the counterintelligence team is hugging the southern part of the map. And I think they'll escape the militia. Maybe. It depends on how fast the militia moves through. Oof. And we have learned that some people just can't drive. Yeah, Clay, just park it around the uh, top marker at this ruins here, because this might be our fallback point. We want to keep it intact. We'll just walk through those. That was some tire screeching drifting right there. Yeah. And we've got the first group of Russian forces on the ground, on foot, moving towards their bridge of crossing. Albeit, I think they started a bit far away on that one. I think they could have gotten closer without being spotted. Oh, they... Yeah, they most definitely could have. All right, so it looks like one, three. You Meanwhile, Kuba is taking a squad bridge, almost directly squad into the intel team. And have the other cross. If you deem it necessary, go for it. I trust you guys to coordinate with each other. Understood. We watch the Russian forces Turn. make their way in. Let's go and check on the CIT. See what they are up to. How their communications are going. Because they can't use command comms. Or uh, they only have local. That'll be interesting. Okay, I'll get eyes on this. Squad one to squad three. Let's not all get on this same rocky outcropping. I would say in about 30 seconds... 
Maybe a minute. We're about to get a good fight on this uh, farmstead here. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if it's going to be a good fight. I think it's going to be the end of the round. Because if the CIT yeah, team dies, squad, that's... Uh, three. Once one moves across the True, bridge, it, it could be a slaughter, but I've seen a silent pull off some stuff. And... Yeah, but one he's got Dorf and Guardian with him. True, once and again. on this side, yeah, we do again. have Kuba. Yeah. Chica has pulled in some big kill games. This is not going to end well. I don't care which side it is. Oh no, you should have... Okay, they are behind the hill over there. And it doesn't look like... They might pass each other. No, no, there's no way that's going to happen. They might actually pass each other. Let's get an aerial view for everyone. On the right of the screen is the Russian CIT, and on the left of the screen is the Militia Forces. Oh, no. And they might have actually spotted an atomic... I don't know if you hear him in local chat. I don't. I'm currently in the sky getting an overview on placements. But the way Silent turned around and just went nope in that direction, I'm pretty sure they saw something. They're running side by side with Kuba's Oh, this is not good. This is what I was saying earlier, the oh, <laughs> running side by side, but this is so much different. Can you keep an eye on their chatter over there and see if they uh, spot Silent or Guardian? I am listening, but now they are starting to yeah. run north. Oh my god! They're booking it. Oh my god! If they turn around, if someone turns around, they will see them. No one turned around. Oh. Roger three. We're gonna start crossing. And we've got squads three and five of the Russian forces are about to start crossing their bridge on uh, G9. And that might be what's pulling the militia forces back. No. I don't know where they're headed. But Silent's done a pretty good thing Two, here. Where's it Dorf? Forget, who's in charge of this team? We don't want to walk straight into an ambush. I'm gonna say Silent. Silent's in charge of this, right. charge of this team. Um, he split them up so they can't be knocked out. So two teams of two. That's not bad. One, this is command. Good choice. And in the field, Kuba, nine, two, in a very one. smart move, decided to post That's up, put people all around the forest. Yeah. Try to catch these guys. So I might have to change my bet mid-game. <laughs> I have some insight. Because I was honestly really expecting the uh, militia forces to find CIT by now. I was too, but if uh, this CIT doesn't move, the rest of the militia platoon is about to close in behind them. Yeah, that's not going to be good. Out, Maybe they do know they're there. Squad one, full command. I think they Set. they su suspect they're the, still the in the area the that they haven't got by the lines. But so far, nothing has been said. Copy three, recommend you send one times fire team to my location just so that they're prepared to cross. Once one confirms everybody is across the river, you will move that fire team up and you will follow with your second fire team through. Drive the BTR. Copy. Yeah, it looks like squad four, I think it is, is going to be crossing the bridge at I-8. And everyone else is going to be crossing at... You only got one ops guy. G-9. Unless squad four decides to not... At which then, I don't know. <laughs> All right, at this time, man has no eyes on those infantry oh, contacts or any other contact. Expect contact at any point during your push. I know, it doesn't help that four of us are Understood. doing this, but yeah. Yeah. We've just got 
Lord Chanka and Dorf laying in a wheat field. The most protected place in the uh, entire map. The place where you'd least expect them. Honestly, always the safest. I can't say that because I always expect someone to be in the wheat field just because you can't see in it once they lay down. ND or fire? Oh, there you go. I guess uh, maybe they're not the most expected in real life. Two, but, uh, in squad, yeah. it might be something different. Yeah, it looks like on the Russian side, we've got ND. And oh. Kuba is starting squad to push news, into the farm. Four, this is command. This little farm town. If he gets up in this two-story, yeah, I wonder if he'll be able to see door. All right, looks like Squad Four has started Copy. engaging Copy. contact grid, if to their it. southeast. I'm gonna fly over there and see what that's all about. Yep, so it's squad three and militia side. Squad one for which squad three. We looks like there's probably some record. distant shots. Oh yeah. Roger. Very distant. Uh not really uh any contact right now, Striker. It's kind of I guess the original was Indy and then Julia uh, four. someone returned fire. I don't think they know where each other is. Wow, English. I don't think they know where the other group is. Copy, Juliet 10 4. One recommends you progress south. When. Man. Send for. I'm, I'm gonna start crossing. Go ahead, we gotta go. I'll tell you what, if Dorf or Chanka Roger, decide to move, two. they will be spotted by Kuba. Is Kuba just sitting on that hillside? He is sitting in this blue house, just outside of it, and he's looking in that direction. Oh, that's not gonna be good. And contact like... was spotted crossing the train bridge. Okay, yeah, that is, that's, uh, wait, train bridge? Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, I see it, yeah. Um, yeah, you've got the Russians crossing, the majority of the Russians crossing the, uh, train bridge, and we've got the, uh, Squad 4 up top crossing with the, uh, BTR. As far as I can tell, they have no contact yet. Southeast as one continues to progress. Copy. command Actually, I don't know if Kuba would be able to see them. He's got a tree in his way. It would only be if they try to run out of the field. Hang on, I'm going to get a point of view. They try to run to the left or right. I would. I think he might spot them. Yeah, if they Possibly. ran. Yeah, if they ran straight south from their position, they could get behind the stone wall without being spotted. Though, then again, I don't have binos, and we do have Russian contact. I am floating around talking about a team that's not even doing anything. Reminder, guys, if I give you a recommendation, don't feel that it is an order. I'm not telling you to do that. If I want to tell you to do something, I will. Now we almost lost Wilbur. That would have been sad as Oddball and his guys were taking fire from where the BTR is at Squad 2. Yep, they spotted the BTR. Oh boy. It's going to make this a lot more difficult. I believe. What's your. Looks like Wilbur's group is engaging 
that uh, group of militia straight east of them, I do believe. Which is Copy HVA Headbuster. Once two is across, you can start that. I would like you guys to expedite your crossing. Oh Copy man, but pretty soon. I don't know what to go watch. The squad one is running up behind Dorf and Chaka. And it looks like squad four is opening up. Squad four and two are opening up on that militia force. Uh, on grid, squ grid square J, 10, and 9. Grid line. Oh, man. Man, you want me pushing down with one? All right, so Negative, right now, Flicker and Silver are about to run up possibly to the stone wall. Just uh, behind Chanka and Dorf. And Guardian and Silent are escaping to the southwest without them. Go ahead and cream that tree. So it is the BTR-80 is the one engaging right now. It is none of the uh, infantry. Oh, this is not looking good for the CIT. I oh, mean, no. it's, it's looking fine for half the CIT. It's just not looking good for Dorf and Lord Chanka. They're splitting them. Yeah. They're running by them. They're, they're, they're not running towards them anymore. Exact same no, thing. No, wait. The nuclear squad. potato. Nuclear potato is still moving towards the you field. See oh, no. <gasps> Dorf moved. Nuclear potato. This guy's gun out. Do a little quick He's running towards the wall. Yep, they found him. They called him out. He is setting oh, this up. This is not good. Chanka! Down goes oh. Chanka. <laughs> it's only a matter of time for Dorf. Dorf is oh just shooting God. randomly just lost a, uh, and cussing up a storm. Oh, lat straight over his head. Dang. And they just Lord hit Chunker. him dirty. Yeah, Lord Chunk and Dorf down. That's, uh, that leaves just Guardian silent. Thankfully, they had that good plan to split up. As now, Bush is just spraying into the field. Oh, yeah, they got to hit four just people, and they've only... They've only guaranteed killed two. So they're thinking two, that the other two are still in there, not realizing that they've run seems really like far down there. But now the action is going to lawn darts. Oh, yeah, I didn't see that. Guardian and Silent. If Guardian and Silent can get past this Three, militia, they can get with lawn darts, and lawn darts can escort them back. Because they still have control over the bridge area. Roger, we're gonna, we're gonna move. But not for long. If the majority of the militias move Hotel in, they're 11. gonna get locked down. Roger, Hotel 11, send. We're in contact with us. Now they know the militia's there, but Silent Guardian are still pushing, which makes me think they're gonna try and get the slip on them. Contact south southeast within 100. Find out. Try to engage as best possible. Silent, don't Three. go out in the open, please. Try to get down towards Hotel 11, support one, and then. Two positions, make it. Not looking that right. way. You can tell Silent is a lot more confident than Guardian is right now. Pit, we're gonna oh, have to yeah. fight through this. One, as yep. soon as oh, Chicken right up the hill from him. Your care. Will Silent see him or will Chicken see him? Three, First. Two, and four, we'll cover. Okay, we got a bush. We got fire he opening us. in there now. Oh, oh Fluss McGruff's probably gonna get knocked out by Silent. Do you wanna try knifing? Oh. We've got a suggestion of knifing from uh, Guardian. Silent goes a flat no. Guardian's gonna try getting as close as he can to Fluff's McGruff. Oh, Daniels came around the corner. Down goes Daniels and Fluff's McGruff by Silent. Meanwhile, Chicken and I push blind kids have no idea that their money's just been dumped. Oh, they probably have an idea, but at this point, they. Silent and Guardian oh, are clear to make a run straight for their group. Chicken just called it out and turned around. 
Oh, this isn't good. Silent. Looks like he's going to stay behind. Guardian's running towards his... Towards friendlies. The goal is to Silent getting hit. And pull off rather than pushing. Kuba got a beat on Silent. Silent bandaging. We got any more action well, going on anywhere? Ooh, yeah. Between... Two and three are getting pretty close up there. And the BTR is starting to push up north. Got in the not going to have to worry about that any time soon. Let's go check out what's going on with the... Four, copy, two, engage. Militia force is over here. Three, try not to get too close to that. Juliet, 10 4 count. Yeah, it looks like Guardian and Silent are home free if they can get back before the militia forces push in. Most of my squad dude up. We have two CIT survivors taking them north now. He's three able to send a buddy pair to uh, make contact with us and just escort us in. We've got uh, we... possible enemy foot mobiles to our southeast following us. Copy, we are going to shift the line southwest. Two, I want you to break contact, move towards three's position. Three, I want you to break southwest into Solo Niki and cover one. Break, break, break. Three is taking enemy fire from the Dishkateki coming from our east. Copy from your east. Two, try to engage that techie, likely in that Juliet 10 4 area. Four. Four. WG, crawl down the hill to your north. Ooh, east someone just popped up. Copy, copy. I'm here. I'll just gain your contacts. Skip. Roger, Start contact Roar, southeast you to about. And I bet Pelican is feeling very confident right now. Copy to your southeast. See his I want squads you to, break to cover. Northwest, then Vaughn and the, you need to plug the, hole in the line counterintelligence team to get three. away. He is, they are forming up a line to guard the bridge so that uh, their east, CITs can extract. To their east, to your east. Careful food, that next ridge. Technically, they only need one to survive, but they were able to get two. The more the merrier. One has it it's so more than I thought was going to get across. Two more than what I thought. I think I underestimated how much uh, Rubba could do. Uh, we're, we're playing too much Halo with them. Heading for the uh, bridge crossing, uh, probably in about uh, two, three minutes. Security, okay. Copy, two, three minutes. And it looks like the militia forces are smoking east of Nightmare. Possibly going to try and push up to stop the CITs from crossing the bridge. It sounds like Kuba is really wanting to push now. Thinking that they completely got through and indeed they have. Yeah, they really need to start pushing. To it. Uh, we have but the issue is India if they start pushing, Copy, India they're going to get wiped out recommend you pull here and there. Westbound, bound sure, a couple will make it through, but not enough to stop on foot CITs. You know, pulling west and then I link up with. You gotta remember the BTR-80 is across the uh, east side of the uh, river now, so it is behind the uh, militia forces. The militia has a nice line coming here for that uh, kind of peninsula where the bridge is, but yes, squad two and four with the BTR over here, they can yeah. easily just come up behind them. Now, see, a good choice would be for the Russians to pull the BTR back to the uh, train bridge and cover the CITs, especially if the militia forces pull up to them. But this is going to be really dangerous for them across that bridge because you get a lot of militia forces going to have sight line on it. And right now, this squad led by Jenkins oh, yeah, this is, is really good. wanting to get eyes on that bridge. Oh, this is not going to be good. Thank God they sent someone that is not the CIT across the bridge first. Sadly, he is probably going to die. The three, please expedite that western push. We need to secure the southern side of this bridge. And they called him out. 
And they should be opening fire on these guys. And they might end up hitting... Right. Lawn darts. Lawn darts. Can they nope. kill Silent, though? They Silent's killed Silent! Down. Guardian's the it's only one. The Guardian! Guardian? Can he survive? The one guy they need. Oh, He's Guardian down! down. Militia has successfully killed Man, you still want us, uh, the counterintelligence. Yep. It depends on whether or not the mission admins decide to end it there. At this point, it may just be a retreat. Team, uh, one team must survive and the other must eliminate. Company, this is Platoon. I think at this point, the Russians have said. Nope, I'm out. As to what our next is. And we are getting Wait some one. confirmation on mission. Copy, try to continue to pull across. We need that BDAR to speed their way up and get over towards the bridge, too, if possible. We need some warning fire on the. Copy. We I don't know we'll what they were there. thinking about with this BTR here. You are yeah, they just put two squads and the BTR just straight down, down the hill, hill in a yeah. bad position. Roger, holding I would have backed be up even, and gone across the other bridge. Yeah, they'd be in uh, even more trouble if... Uh, Alright, it looks like Russia has to hold Selinki. Which is not good because they have no foothold for Selinki. I want you to move southeast. Try and take the there road is a whole Indian wall terrain, of militia forces. East side of Solininki. Four, three. This is command. This is going to turn into actually I want you guys the militia holding Solininki while the Russians One, attack. Yep, pretty much. You're a small unit one. I want you pushing southbound along the hills, trying to engage enemy forces as you go. The problem for the Russians is those guys that successfully got across the bridge now have to come back. <laughs> oh, yeah. I spoke too soon. I jinxed the entire Russian team. If you can't go to the southwest, don't wait for fire to die down. My bets never fail. Eh, never deal in absolutes. Stay low. Wait, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> yeah, I just saw him. Oh, down goes Jenkins. I think that was Wilbur that got him. And we got Dishka opening up on. I don't know See, what these like guys the are doing across the. On the west side. River. Two, four, I, need you guys I think they want to get back the rest of the platoon to attack, but they're just not going to have the opportunity. No. Oh, maybe they will because squad three on Russia is pushing the remnants of Jenkins squad. Looks like the Russians are massing up around the BTR at this point. Probably going to either push up the hill or continue across. Yeah, I'm here. Uh, train tracks. I want you to go straight south. Fill in the line between two and three. Straight south. Two, this is command. And right now, squad four Come with Kuba, which was three, in Soliniki to defend it, decided to fill south. the gap to help keep these guys, to to north. these guys up north. They can take out this Dishkoteki. That'd be fantastic. I'm honestly surprised the BTR has survived this long. I'm not really. Um, what? What did the did the militia even have any armor that? I know they had some lats, but Enemy are they, they still had? I think it was. So they should have started. They had the possibility of eight lats. And let's see. Command, we pushed uh, infantry off the rocks at. Golf. They're moving south. Copy, good work, one. Count four to lats to the that are alive. I want you to try to keep hitting them. Just keep harassing them off the terrain. 
Yeah, that's what I thought. That, you need to set up yeah. That's what I was uh, saying, Striker. They should have just waited for the BTR to show up and escort them across that bridge. Four, command. Copy of here. Their contacts are uh, really close southeast. I'm engaging. We're, gonna, we're trying to move south. Contacts close east, you said? Southeast. Copy. Mission four, try pull northeast. Maria's got uh, heavy, heavy infantry in front. Uh, to the south of power station. Copy. This Wilbur just constantly in the thick of it here. He's surrounded by nothing but uh, militia from his front and his right. This is just two, this is absolutely great. become a dogfight. Yeah, Go for two. pretty much. Uh, let's see what the kill count is south. at the moment no, for the Russians. Base. Looks like we got 12 kills for the Russians and 10 for the... Right. Or my bad. 12 kills for the uh, militia and 7 kills for the Russians. Man, this is for my... The rest of my squad's down. They can't push uh, any more south. Roger. Well aware. I expected as much. I just want you guys to slowly progress south. You need to fight a battle at range. At this point, these guys are shooting at nothing. The majority of the militia have moved down the hill. Except for Silver. What is Silver doing? I killed one guy. I can't even find Silver. Uh, that is a great question, Bell. I have not a clue if that one was out of play. I think it was. Ooh, silver. You're clear to engage. Nuclear potato moving up with silver. Probably not going to end well for either one of these two. Nightmare. Oh, no. Grenade in for... Overshot. Nightmare gets silver. Nuclear potato just giving himself away. He is like just in a last stand, and yep. down he goes. Wilbur's crew is just making a roll on these guys. I say that, but we've got an entire group of Russians dead trying to crush that little field. And the militia still has quite a force just left over in Soloniki. Command, you have contacts yeah. north of you. Three and five. I think it's going to come down to uh, the BTR. No. You don't I think? think? The B I think the BTR is going to get taken out. It's possible because it is currently driving into the view of JV, who is a lat. Uh, Notorious, this is round one. As well as on that and what a round it was. Push through, do as much damage as possible. I am for sure going back and clipping the CIT team going right beside Kuba. Kuba squad. It was too oh, good. Yeah. That was... We got contest to our west. Oh, Lord. That was too close. Silent almost made it, too. It looks like the BTR is taking shots from the other Dishka. Ooh, Lat! JV's down. But it looks like he hit it? He did, but it wasn't Not major. Up. Yeah. Now I believe, with this being vanilla and not modded, it does take more hits to take out that BTR. Yes, that is very true. Let's go back over to Wilbur and find out what's going on over here. I see a lot of people Service. dead. Or is that just CG food? That's just CG food. G that I killed. You're welcome, by the way. Yeah, I was figuring that. He missed every single shot. He sucked. Yeah, he's pretty terrible. Man, this is one. We're gonna move back north across the bridge. Cop, do it. Two. Try to Two. push a little bit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, also check fire, yeah. anatomic. Three, 
I think his buddy got killed. He's on the other side of the hill oh, from Raggy Tinkerbell Lego. Raggy's guys binos out, getting shot at from across the field. Yeah, Lima and Tinkerbell. His group over there is keeping them safe. Here goes Tinkerbell. Tinkerbell should have an eye on him now. And Anatomic no. is not looking. Oh, he can't hear him. How? Oh, he knows now. Anatomic is gonna. Your driver is really into. Tell him to keep your... And he just took over the squad as well. Oh, this is not good. Tags Tinkerbell, but does not kill him. Meanwhile, BTR just open in a field. And I think Tinkerbell is chalking up to crossfire. Not even believing that someone close by. Oh, and a grenade goes out. Too far. Oh, I didn't notice the BTR pulled up straight in front of Raggy's group. First, Potato, now Anatomic. People are just getting stranded. See, this, you remember how you were talking about at the beginning? Uh, people crossing the vision but not seeing anyone? Yep. There you go. We've had two instances now. The problem is, I'm always commanding and squad leading. I'm never, you know commentating and in the stream and watching it. I think commands yeah. down. I think there's a downside to uh commanding. Commanding. Command. Yeah. No, wait, what? Are your words okay? No. No, they're not. <laughs> they never are. Anatomic's still alive down here. Somehow surviving. He's still popping shots at them. Hasn't hit him, and I this still don't think they know he's there. But the BTR is getting really brave. Oh, the BTR doesn't have to really worry about who. How many uh, lats or hats do you have left? Uh, there's at least one because I heard it overshoot. Let me check. I see. Two. Only two left. That sounds. Okay. Let's go that way. All right, we're gonna move west to the river. Headbuster and Alpha Guido. From the west. <laughs> so the BTR-80 is not even gonna see him because Anatomic is just sitting there by the rock. Turret's not even looking at him. Anatomic might get away scot-free in this one. I didn't even notice Oscar Mike is in the field what? behind Anatomic, and the BTR just drove right by him. Oh, wow, he is. <sighs> Good lord. The Russians are blind. And down goes Wilbur. Alright, Jens. And yeah, now it's Nightmare. Shit, literally just a dead Oh, Guido oh, got behind push. this entire group. Oh, jeez. Down goes Tinkerbell. Can deer survive? Deer's not looking in the right direction. Nice. It's like Throw Scottish tag Guido to hill. save deer. Leave to Alpha Guido and to make it feel like there's a whole squad Flicker pushing him. is coming around on the north to help Guido, and he's about to take out Nightmare. No, but he, Nightmare, no gets him. Nightmare takes him down. I'm covering. You. And I think Guido just prioritized himself taking down the BTR instead of these guys. Yeah, that's going to be their major issue right now. What's that BTR AD season? Four souls fighting the BTR. <laughs> miss ah, or hit? Ah. Miss. That was a miss. And right before he shot it, he yelled, this is for my sweet summer child. <laughs> and uh, then missed. Not worth it. Rocket, so you guys decide, are we just going in scratch or? That, Alright, BTR, Looks like everyone's gonna pile on with the BTR. Alright, stand here or just try to get all angles around the BTR. 
Looks like Guido's gonna have another go at it as he's pushing the hill. And the BTR is about to walk right underneath him. Sorry, correction, right above him. Yeah, I was about to say, wait, what? Yeah, but a lat's not gonna be doing any good at this range. To make it even worse, I don't think he has any left. I don't think so either. How many times has he shot? Once or twice? I believe he shot twice. And oh, no. he's running up to it. Deer. And I don't Anyone think see it? he knows. Oh no! Deer sees him. But he's down. Nightmare's on the edge. I can't believe that just happened. Oh, down goes Alpha Guido by Nightmare. Down goes Guido, but somehow Oscar Mike now believes it's his turn to get some guys. He is yeah, a sapper. Like Command has come down and told the Russian forces they must take the city. They cannot sit here on the hill. Down goes Deer. Oh, Deer was Command too. Scott has tried to get Oscar Mike, but missed. I don't think anyone else... I don't think anyone else on now, uh, Russian team has command comms at this point. There is only Oscar one person... Mike is a sapper kid. There was I only one person. Mags. This is not fun. Only one person <laughs> I heard what command came no down way, to no. say, and that was uh, Deer. And Deer was about to say it. There. Just make sure they don't push up close. It never got communicated. Mm-hmm. Okay, I think I took that guy's head off. Hey, look, oh no. South. Southeast. The other lat He's moving from militia is dead. Yes. That, was, that was the wrong fucking button. And we have a misclick. Smoke went out on accident. Completely destroying the chance of getting rid of one of the Dishkatekis. This turns south real fast for the Russians. It looks like Nightmare and Scottish Chap are gonna go oh, after the Dishkateki. What? He opens up, then we get him. But then that means he's in the gun. I deny yeah, him see that dish coming gun. around. Oh, dude, don't poke your heads out, guys. Yeah, what's called? Listen, man, it's deathmatch. We're lost. All we can do is get as many kills as we can. Nightmare! Oh, they oh, finally no. got one of the dishkas! Did you get the gunner? They still don't have the driver, though. I just, I didn't really get the gunner. And I think and he's gonna get away scot free. Nope, nope. Nightmare's nightmare's bloody now. He's he's going for it. No, he's right. pulling back. Uh, but they got the gunner. That's all that matters. I guess we just go die. <laughs> Nightmare says, "I don't know what to do anymore. I think I'm just gonna go die." That's not good. Is that Oscar Mike or is that a net? What is Oscar Mike doing? So he was up here with Guido, but. Now that Guido's dead, I don't think he knows what to do. He's got his binos out. I guess he's keeping tab on the uh, BTR-80. He's not talking. Oh no, he has an IED out. Ooh. Anatomic is down just past Oscar Mike and... Down goes there nightmare. goes Nightmare. That Meanwhile, leaves... there's a whole squad yeah. sitting in sword. I'm pretty sure that leaves Rather Scott's Chap and Dayman. They are the last two alive, the Russians. Oh, a lot oh, straight to the shot. face of Oscar Mike. Dang, rather Scottish chap not having it. 
Oscar Mike just got voted off the island. Yes. He is out of here. He got voted real hard. Now, I wonder if Scottish will load up in the BTR and if they just go for it. Now, I'm not sure how this works, but I don't think you're yeah, supposed know. to... Oh, it looks like Brother Scott's shot yes. might be... I'm gonna take your ammo. There are times in situations like these that you. they'll allow it. Yeah, I'm, I'm Certain seeing circumstances. But normally this wouldn't happen. Normally, the driver would have to abandon the vehicle. Or continue using it, but as a scout. This BTR? No, they got a dish attack. He's staring them straight down. Just to confirm, yet there are no lats, but there are. The dish attack he can get a beat on. One sapper. A sapper. I would love to see an IED hit it, but I don't think I will see it. No. And vanilla IEDs are freaking overpowered. Or if he goes to the center section, there is a mine there, I believe. Yes, there is. So there is a possibility of that. Come to the right of me. 247, there's an SL with Binox. I want you to shoot him in the face and then just, you know, let him know. Just the power of it, you know? Uh oh, it looks like Revy's about to get punched in the face by a bullet. I have to angle lower than this. F. Looks like someone's throwing green smoke. For some reason? I'm not sure. Nothing in that direction. Newton down. What happened to Newton? Yeah, he's still up. On. Oh, is They're he? Somewhere in the woods. Okay. Yep. Newton believes there are two infantry for where Scottish is. Some I don't know who. Someone called out that the B Tower was at the yellow smoke and they are way off. I mean Not too far off, but he's in the general area. Let's get, uh, 50, 75 meters. <laughs> he's still in the general area. Rel I mean, he's, he's on the edge of a Relatively. field. It's really hard to miss him. I don't think anybody on the Musha team really is confused about where the BTR is. No, no, probably not. You have two minutes to secure the town before you're nuked into oblivion, day man. And, yeah. <laughs> It looks like the event admin has right. come in to say that, uh, well, if they don't start moving, they're going to get nuked. That's my favorite. I've done it before. It's very exciting. Watch these buildings. And that might have actually been Scottish that I did it to. Oh, that is not That would nice. be very sad. Very sad if it happens again. They're in the town, technically. It's 
what we really need. The only person that could take out this BTR right now is Jam, who happens to be driving the dish Gateki. Who came up with that idea? Oh, it's Quantum all speculation. Oh. oh, Quantum gets rather Scottish, so he doesn't worry. Have to worry about being new. Dayman though is on his own. He's alone. He's scared. And there's smoke. Oh. I think at some point Damon's just gonna have to accept his fate and hop on out. I hope not. All right, buddy, you have to get out. I'm being to believe that Damon is really trying. Word for word. Well, if Damon doesn't get out of the vehicle soon. Out of the BTR. Might be getting a little push. Right. And he's out. And he's going to go for Lima. With a pistol. Down he goes. All right. And I do believe that should have been GG. GG. All right. That's round one. We will be back after a short break. Yo. All right, gents, uh, we've received uh, some intel from our spy and the militia team. Uh, we sent in some forces to retrieve it. Uh, however, uh, their location has been identified by the militia and that they're after them. We've lost communication and we need to go in there and extract them. Uh, once we make contact, we're going to extract them to Neva Upper and then hold there until we can decode the message. So the way we need, we're going to cross the river is we're going to stage a beachhead in uh, Gulf 9. We're going to set up the BTR there, which will be handled uh, by Jenkins squad. He's going to set up his BTR and his rifles along the high ground. Once they're set up, Oddball squad and Kuba squad, they're going to cross... Um, Undercover along the lower bridge. Oddball squad's going to continue moving east. Uh, and then Kuba squad's going to have a, a more southern vector. At the same time, Fulcrum, he's going to take one of, the, uh, one of the transport trucks. He's going to dump it somewhere in Hotel 8, and he's going to get eyes across the river. He's going to assist Oddball with movement, make sure he doesn't get any uh, hit from the north. And if he deems that area clear, he's going to cross the bridge on that side. And be a northern element for us once we're across uh we're basically just going to make sure that you know the counter intel team's kind of by themselves we're going to take care of the platoon first and worry about the intel second uh once we're across we're basically going to maneuver whichever way the counter intel team is moving we don't have comms with them uh so we'll do our best to link up if they should all die uh hq has ordered us to hold saloniki and maintain a presence on this side of the river is that all clear? Do we know if their plan is to move or to stay put? Not too sure. I don't have comms with them. All good? All good. All right, SL's break them up. All right, admin, we're ready. All right, and uh, that was the Russian briefing. Nothing, it's a little bit different compared to round one's Russian briefing. Um, they're focusing more on the platoon than they are on the CITs. Can we make sure we load it in the right Because at the end of the day, if the CITs yeah, get destroyed, the platoon has to take Solanke anyways. So if the platoon's not in a functioning position, then uh, 
it doesn't matter what they do, they're going to lose. The, the regular one... Yeah, we're pretty actually similar because Rebel wants to try to deny them at the bridges instead of trying to attack the CIT directly. Look at the ceiling. Look at the ceiling. It's got carpet. Yeah. Yeah. So I think our CRT is going to live for a while. Hey, they even got a mattress in the back. Here we go. We are live. Now we must wait for all the action to start once more. Hopefully it will start a little bit sooner. Depending on how uh, Rubber runs his crew on the militia side. Because it sounds like Revy's going to do the slow crawl. I think they're all headed for uh, train bridge. If I remember correctly, it'll be Londark squad that will be watching train bridge. Who's driving this trans trucky? Trans truck. I keep saying trans trucky because Dishkateki. Am I the only one who does that? Poss possibly. No. I'm sure there's. I'm sure there's others out there. Don't worry. Oh, Just shit. not knobs. What fascinates me though is the way that the uh, we'll, tailgate we'll on that lodgy is just um, flapping. Oh yeah, 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 I noticed that earlier. Really. It was bugging me. Like so really? It blows my mind. <laughs> well, it, it flaps, but then it gets to a certain port, point in the map where I guess it just has a reset or something, and it just spazzes out. Yeah, we could drop it off here. But yeah, the fact that it has a uh, physical flap on the back, that is honestly really interesting, yeah. Is it really needed? Probably not. Oh man, I can see so far. A little hazy. Revy, being awe inspired by his position to drop out of his uh, trans truck, as uh, he is. First words out of his mouth is, "Ah, such a great view." Yeah, we're into the lower. We see have everything. Yeah, to continue moving to the bridge, I want us crossing eventually. Where's the militia at? Okay, uh, they have say, then two set, squads set, on Farmstead, so that is, is going to be about 200 meters guess... east of Soliniki. Oh, man. One, uh, one squad is south of that with the Dishkatekis, and one is all the way up north, closing in on Radio Tower. That's right, enemy can't blitz us and it until doesn't look like somebody crosses first. CITs are even moving. They are I, bush hiding. They learned their lesson. They learned their lesson. They're not allowed to do that. <laughs> they died. They restarted. They can't they can't learn from their first mistake. Uh, like Sorry. AI. They have one program. One Run. Seven. Yep, pretty much. After taking some fire, retreat. If they're lucky. Does anyone hear an engine? Uh, command, you hear an engine? Native, but. Well, if we die, we. Ooh, we gotta open up. BTR is shooting something. Oh, and it is firing possibly on Wilbur. Send me some grids when you got him. Contacts in India 10. India 9. Yep, straight on him. Fulcrum, get your guys hit the cross, hold them in the ditch. So let's uh, make sure the area is clear before we do. And to no surprise. Gunning it for his redemption is Guido. Yep. 
his idea there was if you can't kill it, join it. Yep. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, meters to your Russians making us a good time here getting across the uh, river. It's like Squad 2 might be coming in contact with Squad 4 of the Militia on the upper bridge. This guy's getting across the train bridge doing really well. They should get a good position on uh, Militia. Those first shots count. Oh, maybe. It looks like Militia's uh, Squad 3 is moving in for Selinki. We've got contacts to our north too. Oh, you see them southeast too? They definitely see us to our southeast. Uh, like I-96? Yeah, I-965. Buddy team. With an MG and Binox set up. Yeah, there's a guy right there. He just peeked back. Hold on. What? Oh. So oh. got some uh, crossfire oh, no. from the Russians to the... Wait, Sam, try to find depression. Um, is, hey, I, I got uh, contact. Militia forces. Behind the, uh, tree by Squad Radio 4 of Militia. Oh, this... Oh, hey, Dorf goes down. One, one, Dorf one. down already? The uh, techie went south onto a hill, and it just destroyed Dorf. Whammy oh, to the face. man. He got deleted. Okay, one, Let me go over uh, and see if they're chatting. Three gets a little bit further ahead. Be, we probably got like a minute or two before they start engaging yeah, heavily. Like we might have a squad if Chanka was tapped out, I'm sure he's tapped in and scared again. Yeah, they're pulling that way east, southeast. He's not moving. Looks like one time's assist team has gone. Silent is still on the move. Unlike Guardian and uh, Shanka, they are just, he's moving. He's like, uh, -uh I'm not sticking. Three and four, do your best to continue moving. Which he might have the best plan. Until if he can back up and around uh, Industrial Park, and he might be up. able to get past majority uh, of the, uh, the intelligence team. militia forces. Honestly. He One could possibly sneak through. Uh, it's just a lot of open fields. Oh, yeah. Sporadic open fields. Two, let's keep some pressure up at this north bridge. Copy. And we've got some heavy fire over at the northern bridge. Okay, the are passing, so I think we're just going to go straight to the team. So. See what they're like. Oh, Here, yeah. they're on the south side of the road. Okay, can you so just glass this guy and tell me if he's peeking aside? 109, top of the hill, about 300 meters out. I see three of them by the tree. You, you got one so Wilbur is saying he can see right the two. exit ramp of the train bridge. Two, yeah, so if nine, four, anybody two, comes off it or on it, he will see them. I don't know if they believe that the CITs are safe or not. Because they are pulling the technicals out from the south. Well, they have no idea what the, the uh, rest of the CITs are. And if I'm they thinking, start... those guns, I, I honestly think that they don't know they killed Dorf. I think they do. I think I'm, I'm, I might have missed it over command comms. Got a lot of fire going on over here. Uh, I got some fire being shot back and forth between the uh, militia and Russians at the northern bridge. A lat out hitting the side of the mountain where everyone was just That's a moment ago. Hey, he hit the Did I say mountain? Hill. Yeah, I Rock saw. formation, like, oh, whatever. Such a it's a decent shot Speaking sent out by drawing. Scottish. Eh, decent. Decent. But no bar talk level. No bar That's what I was going to say. No bar talk. I did not know what those guys Ooh, Wilbur and Quantum getting Two real close. This, uh, north bridge. Let's start bounding down south. Let's see if we can get across there. Need assistance, one please, with your 
Quantum's gonna cross Wilbur's view. You guys look for contact. I'm gonna watch our left flank here to the. Did Wilbur just go down? No. Yeah, Wilbur's down. Wilbur is down. Straight south. Roger, guys Wayne got him. I think Wayne or Silver got silent. No. Is it me? F for Wilbur. And meanwhile, they really pushed up uh, these Russians. Uh, the CIT team moving away oh, yeah. from squad four, so I'm probably just going to come in behind the contact that you guys are engaging. And I do believe Roger, Nightmare just went down to too. To he did, and there goes CG Fu. WG is over there. He is injured. He goes down, and there goes Texan. Yep, that is. Melissa is getting white. They're too thin. Now, let's now see. they need to be careful because the dish attackies are still rolling back and forth on the southern side, or my bad, the eastern side. They don't have any lats that are really close to this BTR either, so these guys have nothing to fight it with. The enemy is held up in the farm due east of position at 150 meters. I see contacts on the rocks, I-96. Maybe a little bit further than that, like J-94. Am I missing? Where is the rest of the Russian forces at? I see some running around the uh, bridge here. Uh, squad four is all the way south. What the? And it looks like they missed. Oh no! No, oh, they snuck. The yeah, south. they snuck by squad two before they closed in on the uh, shoreline. But now, now I'm wondering where did the CITs go? The south side of the road. The CITs are up in uh, grid there. square. Oh wow! Mike ten. <laughs> they they are going all the way around. Two, let's keep moving towards the platoon and uh, take the north side of the platoon too. Uh, follow the uh, north side of the. And road. I miss it, but Rubba is down, so now Londarts is taking charge. Oh, you! That's not good. Luckily for Rubba, though. Lawn is Command, very extreme. That is true, also. Clear. What do you want, squad four down? Four, keep moving uh, north. Keep moving directly towards the CIT team uh, northeast. Uh, those Russian forces need to be careful. They got uh, You're bound into something. three militias staring them down if they pop this hill. Nuclear potato might lose his head here. Our command's getting shot up. Can you guys press the fire sign? We're here? pushing that. We're pushing that due south of you, command. I believe there's contact due west of three's position right now. Do you want us to move to engage? Three, yeah, engage those guys. Uh, we don't want anybody on the flank. So three, engage those guys. To the I'm west. wondering what uh, Russia Two will do since the CITs are pulling all the way northeast. Well, they've already got a team rolling in, and they might take out one of the Dishkatekis, but they're rolling in to grab. Possibly to meet up with the uh, CITs. Maybe, maybe we should just leave them in Saloniki. I don't, I don't know. Currently, the uh, Russians are trying to decide whether or not they should leave the militia in Saloniki or not. Could do with the BTR support at Saloniki. Our, our objective right now is the CIT team, which is pretty far away from Saloniki. I suggest we break I'm contact still... from Saloniki and we move towards the CIT team. We're just going to have to maneuver through some contacts in the I column. I think the CIT have put the we'll Russian fine. forces you in a bad them. position yeah. here. Because they're all conglomerate around the uh, train bridge. But the CITs have pushed up towards the northern bridge. And squad four on the militia side still has guys up there just hanging around. Oh yeah. But they, even though the Russians have 
fire superiority over here? They, I don't think they really want to push out. No. They're slowly making good work of the uh, militia, but... How did Squad 4 walk go by that Dishkateki? Uh, wow. Hit inside How of a did town. that happen? Huh. Actually, no, that Dishkateki rolled up on their uh, eastern side. Probably behind a hill. Well, the BTR took a shot, possibly two. Ooh, from what? It's got about 75% health, and I believe it was a lat. Um, is it Damon? I don't see him. No, it couldn't have been Damon. I wonder if it was Sergeant Jackson. What are these two rolling? See. I can't tell. Yep, Sergeant Jackson and Kerr are both lats. That's so those two that might have put from. a double hit on it. And if this was modded, I bet that thing would be destroyed. Oh, yeah. Oh, and they're about to run into squad four. Oh, that's not good. Nope, they might have dodged them. Those are two guys they do not want dead. If you want to blitz, I direct. I suggest blitzing to four and then to the CIT team. Roger. Well, guys, I think I'm pushing. Looks like the Russian force is going to try and blitz to They're squad push four. Across the bridge because all it's doing out of the south. I wouldn't. I'm going to go check to see if the CIT sure. are communicating. Let's try it out. Let's try it see out. what they're thinking. Oh, look at this. Dick's folk has come up with a tricky play. He crossed the river on the northern bridge. Yeah. Is up on the rocks. All right. Looks like the uh, CITs are going to hide in the bunker over here. <laughs> well, and these guys have been spotted all the way south from looks like squad two on Russian side. So they might know they're crossing the river. Oh, and the BTR's pulling back across. What is happening? Not a clue. Hey, Seb. Welcome to the stream. Yeah, because they're trying to cross the northern bridge. I'm just going to have to take that BTR. But... It looks like the militia forces are going to try and take residency up on the other side of the bridge. It's gonna make it really hard for Squad Four to. Uh, depends on where Squad Four decides to go once they get the CITs. Okay, have that BTR lock down any infantry that are crossing. Someone that on Dick's folk squad that was across the river just got eliminated by the BTR. But luckily, got some good fire. They still have Scottish with a lat who can possibly take it out. It's infantry of one in the farm. In the farm copy, get some frags and explosives in there. It looks like the militia have moved out of Salinki. Surprisingly low numbers on the kill count, so militia with three and Russia with eight. Yeah, that is really that's low for. We've been at for about 20 minutes now. Maybe a little less. A four, take I know, it feels like a freaking left. lifetime. Okay. Chance of multicam, Sebi. Uh, I believe Not there might be some later the week, though. Possibly. Oh. No? Maybe. I can't promise anything. <laughs> I saw experts mention. Yeah, it depends whether or not uh, our individuals who host, who do uh, run the RTMP server. Are uh, available. Hey, Goud. Welcome to the
the stream. This BTR is just playing with Dick's fuck now. That's just not nice. And it looks like squad Three. one is tailing squad four Your to the Russians. On Soloniki. Wayne's saying there's a fighting sized element still sat in Soloniki. We're gonna hold until further. Oh, and the Good BTR room, is sir. booking it across the bridge. Room. It is gonna run into Scottish with his lat. And yeah, gonna that's going to be a frontal shot. And he missed. He missed it. Extracts the contacts over the, uh, the he CIC overshot over it. The north bridge. Oh. Once we've extracted over the north bridge. We'll Leave it to Alpha Guido. To and deuce. there goes Scottish. And, uh, oh. And that BTR is going to make a B beeline straight for squad four and help with the CITs, I'm pretty sure. Man, that was Scottish's moment, and he ruined it. And meanwhile, this techie is moving right in front of the BTR, so and they're you, about to fight. If you want to bring your PR to the field, that's to my west. If, uh, you pick yeah, Roger, the guy's pushing. That. All right. Yeah, you've got the BTR up there along with a uh, BTR. Fuck, the techie. The disco techie's running <laughs> away from the BTR. Uh, commands northeast, moving north. He wants nothing to do with it. No, I wouldn't want anything to do with it. And I think Guido and Flicker and the BTR are going after him. They are. I'm gonna get in a little closer. This looks like they're talking local arms. We gotta, we gotta get the four, dude. We gotta get the, the four. Chase the chase and Zeus. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Sit rail on. I just. Leave. No, it looks like uh, Flicker no. was the one going right. after it. Uh, Guido's like, right. no, we're yeah. going to four. We're going to four. Not chasing the the discotheque. Reloading. No fun for you, Flicker. No fun. Copy. Temperature spot crossing back east across the north bridge. Copy. Squad 4 has the uh, CITs with them. So that's good. I don't know. Does the BTR 80 have extra seating in it? Yes, it is definitely able to fill a whole squad inside of it. It looks like they're gonna they're gonna uh, have it. Two of the uh, CITs will go on the BTR, and the other two will be on foot with the rest of the squad four. So splitting up again. It almost worked for him last time. Hopefully, it works this time. I think they have a better chance with the armor. Extract across the northern bridge or the south bridge. You have unknown amount of contact. You've got unknown amount of contacts on the north. You got a oh, yeah. there and you got guys crossing back. East Events are so much fun. We've You'll love it once you get in. Down, oh yeah. Soloniki. Just keep uh keep an eye on the calendar for our basic. We mounted, mounted two once you get that, you go. I kept one with myself on. I think we make our way back to you guys. So I went and checked in on the south, and it is essentially stalemate. Yeah, I didn't expect much to be going on over there. Wow, that is a yawn that I did not expect to show up. Alright, the rest of the squad just keep up long range. Yeah, they're just trading some fire back and forth. Alright, we've right. got two CITs uh, and the BTR. Time. It looks CIT like the BTR up. might be going down south along the road and possibly pushing up through Industrial Park. And then pushing through to the bridge behind squads two and one. I'm pretty sure with them encountering squad four up on the northern bridge and that techie up there, they don't want to risk it. They got the rest of the down here. Might as well stick with them. And it looks like the militia are trying to counter it by pushing to the bridge. Yeah, there's no contacts on northeast of one. Okay, I'm just gonna walk straight towards you from where I'm at. Okay, before be advised, we had contacts crossing east across the north bridge, and I saw that techie flying up to the north. Okay, go. Okay, so is the whole platoon uh, trying to get across the northern bridge, or just uh, the CIT team? We're kind of playing it by ear, reacting to contacts at the moment. 
Wow, so in all of that action, Militia are still sitting at three kills, and Russia went up to went up by four, so they're at 12 now. Oh, jeez. With all that going on, minimal kills. Do we have to wait for the, all of the CIT team, or just the first? We just need to get one uh, back to the upper. I think this time oh, around we're... Lewis. Oh? There's trading fire in the south. Yep. As I said, the militia are trying to take over of my the uh, train bridge. If they can take it over, they are going to deny that BTR the ability to get across it. Three more moving through the woods to our west. They got some pretty good movement behind the hill. Which will give them a perfect view on that BTR and any infantry trying to cross. Yeah, I think we can, uh, we've got a stronger force on the south bridge, so we're going to concentrate on the south bridge. We've got two ARs, no, yeah, two ARs and two LATs. I, uh, BTR as it moves making their way towards the bridge on the militia side. By squad back to I'm pretty sure that is locked down now. And a BTR would be stupid to try and push it at this point. Now, not far from this train bridge is four over at the northern bridge. They actually have eyes on the whole thing. Ooh. So they could easily shift over and catch these guys crossing if they do make it there successfully. Yeah, I see. Yeah, we all have important parts. And it looks like they uh, just dropped off Chanka and Guardian. No, this is actually the most important part. Yeah. You let me die, you don't get a tank. The BTR is now without its CIT baggage and doesn't have to worry about losing any of that. Downside is the militia have definitely solidified their ability to hold down that bridge. Three, start the assault. Start clearing the way for three, for four. It looks like they're going to start pushing. Uh, squad three of the Russians are going to start moving in on the militia forces and try and force them out. Yeah, I think the right play here from the Russians is to get the whole platoon together, push these guys off, and then cross that bridge. So well, see, if the they push option. it too hard, if they push it too hard, they're gonna pull the rest of the Russians from the uh, northern bridge. Which I mean, that'd be pretty good because then they can just backtrack with the BTR and go straight over it. If they can push, pull the uh, Russians far enough, or militia. That would work. Copy, copy. Let's uh, use the BTR four and three. Keep maneuvering that way. Uh, crush them in. Let's get the BTR up on the hill. Give it some high. Two and one. Uh, cover our six. Now I thought of a cheeky play. If if they had a sapper, they could place a mine there at the southern bridge, but they actually did it at the northern bridge. Yeah. So if the BTR goes up there, it might be destroyed. It depends on who's driving. It's Flicker, and he's pretty good at spotting things on the road. That being said, he's also a rally fan, so he might be speeding. <laughs> oh, no. Sir, were you speeding tonight? Why, yes, yes, I was. Oh, now here's this movement. Uh, they're pushing the BTR up to the train bridge as well with a squad. And Evan, and who is this? Danger closer right underneath the train bridge. Oh, no. They're pushing the BTR up there, but BTR can't push all the way across the train bridge. One, start moving back slowly, but keep an eye on our side. Actually, no, no, let's not, not put it. Let's push back up. Let's get, let's get off this fucking wall. Remember again. <laughs> Alpha Guida's like, why are we on this bridge? Back up, back up, back up. Oh, Evan is about to take out Kuba right below the bridge, possibly. 
No. As well as chicken? No, they're not going to do anything because the BTR is there. You could say they're a uh, passive scout force. Oh, and they got spotted by Koopa. Yeah. Who would take some both down? I can't move alone. Koopa killed two rats, as he says. Those are some hawks out there, and they are putting some extra fire just to be safe. Sorry, Evan, but it was your time to go. Oh, yeah. Right along with that, took down half rat. Wiped nice out contacts under the bridge, the train bridge. So and this is starting to become a one-sided fight with five kills like, on militia and yeah, eighteen on the, on the Russians. Trees. Yeah, at this point. BTR can't cross the river. I don't know how many. Still got one lat up over here for the uh, militia. Who's gonna go rock on the bridge? Over. What about over it here? Looks like Squad Two has. Deer and Damon. Oh, it looks like they're going to try and preempt the BTR with the Dishkoteki across the bridge. Yep, so Deer and Damon are, have eyes on that bridge that it's going to okay, try, so we me. might see the BTR get taken out here soon. Okay, block. Can we get across up to Neva? Up block it. Keep it. Engaging those guys to your west. Uh, one's gonna start falling in uh, behind three. Three's gonna work on these guys to the west as well. Four's so trying to make their way across. We have contacts on our side. Golf on six. We have contacts in Golf nine nine. Yeah. Solid copy. We're holding. Oh no, these two lats have no idea the BTR's over here. Nope. Ooh, someone shot a rocket at him. That was Damon taking down Fulcrum? Those two lats are hightailing it, trying to catch up that BTR-80. Yeah, and the BTR, BTR is crossing now. But on the other side is a dish the 2IC, yep, which is taking command with Gonzo Kai, which, if I'm not mistaken, he is also a lat. I am sorry, Spat from, uh, Smack. Uh, this is a one life event. Um, we require that any participants go through our basic before joining. Guys on our side of the hill, is that what they're doing? That's what they're doing. Nice. I don't know where the BTR 80 is going. He just hightailed it. Oh, you know what? No, I, I still don't know where he's going. He's gone. <laughs> BTR 80 has run away. Flicker is possibly going AWOL. Goodbye, Flicker. Nope, nope. Flicker's turned around. He's going up the hill along the roadside to try and get on that uh, upper area. Oh, and Juan <laughs> and uh, Godzilla guy decided to leave it, I guess, and they're going to go for infantry with this dish Kateki. Kuba is not going to be doing so well on this this bridge. Oh, there he goes. Will the BTR get here fast enough to save its teammates? First, uh, cross it's not looking like it. No. Let's get, we need to get a good base of fire off oh. the contacts. Uh, Maybe he's hightailing it now. It's not really much to worry about as long as the Russians don't push the bridge yet. Right. That Dishka has no idea that BTR 80 is back there. Understood for. As far as you know, I know, and he is continue pushing. booking it right now. The north, I'm guessing. Uh, we're very compromised to the north, yes. Here comes the BTR-80. Let's uh, uh, just wait for this BTR-80. Some dudes up. Hold. 
Oh, Lon is telling him to run. Alpha. I don't I see anything right now. So much. How do you not see that? Right, right, right. Techie, right, techie, right. Close, close, close. Squad two, sit rep, please. Oh, yeah, it's abandoned. Oh, is he seeing now? Abandoned tech. He's looking yeah. right at it. Right, yeah. Um, Alright, Gonzo guy is getting ready to put a shot on this thing. Two, can you get on that river and clear that oh, maybe so not, because he only has a frag rocket loaded. Oh, what a uh, shot. Watch you guys watching north. Two is gonna clear out the west Gonzo right. just toss a lad yeah, across to the kill push. fluffs. He did. Oh, beautiful Sorry. shot. Four and three is gonna watch northwest and north. And now he is loading in anti-tank. He's loading the heat, That's and he's about to put a shot on Guido. Start shooting at the hills. One's gonna try and cross. I get some smokes down, but he hit the tree. <laughs> ah! Okay. You gotta make sure you got no branches in front of you. I'm sure Lawn Darts isn't happy right now. You guys got like two uh, this is quite clear. an op for flat shots. Oh yeah. Only only fails really. Oh most definitely. Squad four. Four, you're just watching the north along with you're watching the northeast and the north. Just hold this Does down. Somebody else get some... wanna take silent. CIT, let's see. Uh Targets, putting some keep their heads down. CIT are right here. We've got uh, Guardian and Shanka being escorted by Revy, and Silent is being escorted by Newton. Currently, the holdup is Londarts and Gonzo Guy over here on this ridge. Once they're out of the way, I'm pretty sure the Russians are just gonna book it across that bridge. Oh, another lad attempt from, uh, what was that? I think that was Deer? Oh, yep, probably was. Yep, that would've been Deer. Understood, let's get that BTR to work. Looks like the BTR is taking a position at the other end of the bridge with lawn darts and Gonzo guy sitting right above him. So uh, this is quite the predicament. Lon and Gonzo guy on this side, as well as Clay, Delik, and Kerr, and about three to four times that many guys are wanting to cross that bridge. Oh, yeah. Okay, two, I'm taking some casualties up here. Once you clear out that river, uh, I want you to try and make a push for that bridge. With four and three. Alright, this, uh, uh, this is Alpha taking over for one. I just got a call. Yeah, go ahead, one. Let's see, was that no, from Deer? Deer uh, wanted to go uh, around. But little did he know, he had five guys river. around him. Right, we're at Sorry, it looks like Flicker and Alpha Guido are moving up near danger. There goes Deer and Lego. They are down. The only guys left from Militia are across the river on the western side. Which is exactly where the Russians want to go. Yeah, and it looks like the BTR-80 is circling these uh, Militia forces over here to the north. Now, let's one. see. Top of that Bad Lake to or... take out Gonzo guy. Is yeah, copy. Not... Uh, we're just gonna have to deal with it. Is here? So... Lake R is alive. It looks like... Try and get stacked up on that bridge. I don't know. Maybe he tried to get with Lawn Darts, but now he's running back to Clay and them. Because he is a scout kit. Flicker has decided to abandon the vehicle. Oh, and so did BTR Guido. 80. Yep, BTR-80 is down. Oh, this is not good. And now they're just lobbing lats at the uh, 
at Londarts and Gonzo Guy, trying to take them out. Now, Rebby's still alive, and they have okay, smoke one, two, and three, barrages. Start advancing on this peninsula. Get by oh, Londarts down. down. And that was down nuclear potato. Down, we're gonna make this cross. No. Who was that? Who's got a lad over here? It was silver. Squad three moving west. No. Phil and I. Three, we're gonna move drive west from your position. So Londarts is down. That leaves Gonzo guy on his own over here, and he's taking up position where they're gonna to have to come by him. I would love to see, and I know Brevi has it. Is them to put down a smoke barrage and cross this bridge. Be beautiful. Um, no, odds are it got disabled. Uh, probably a tire's out on it. Keep eyes out up top. We, we gotta make or something across. like yeah, it looks like the engine's on fire, so they may have lost engine we power. Don't have the time to, uh, to go all the way around the north bridge. The BTR-80 is out of play at this point. And they still have a Dishkateki. If Gonzo guy really wanted to, he could hop on the back of that and just watch this uh, hilltop. Oh, well, these guys are popping smokes along the bridge, but it looks like Clay J is holding them off. Man, if Gonzo guy had one rocket that he could put in this grouping, he could easily possibly take out all three CIT. Yeah. Ooh, bad lap. Let's get the fire down. If, if you're not crossing, you're shooting. All right, we got a wall of smoke going up. Not in the right place, though. Need it on the bridge. And it is going nowhere but into the river. And... Lion Kids is realizing that he's not supposed to be in the river. Oh! Who did that just no. get? No! Did he kill all three of them? No, I think Silent's still up. No! Where is Silent? He got all three! He killed all three He killed all three! Oh no! They're all dead. You called it. You called I... it with the lat shot. <laughs> and I'm not hearing any command comms, so I don't think anyone realizes that all the CITs are dead. That's the bandit. That's exactly. Oh, I'm gonna be out. Medic, I'm gonna I can manage you. I can manage you. Nice. For you uh, boys and girls that went through your basic, there's a thing called spacing. It doesn't exist in here. Does not exist. Yep, there's Cat with the spacing. Keep it. Love it. Learn it. Never forget it. Because a lat shot can be the difference between winning a match and losing it. This whole op I've been saying, it's just been constant bad shots with the lat. That was amazing. Yeah. And now it's completely turned around. You've got... Well, it's not completely turned around. It looks like it's been called out. It is now a fight out. It's a duke out. It is the Russians against the militia. Whoever is last, uh, last standing is a uh, winner. This is going to take a while. Militia are very spread out. Oh, yeah. But they are picking off guys very well. It's because the Russians don't have a very good foot. Quantum might get knocked out here by uh, Gonzo guy over here on top of the hill. Roger. I believe he spotted them. Oh, oh, he pulled out a lat. 
Put that away. Yeah, we can give it a shot. Oh, there he goes. down goes quantum. Um, yeah, Stu. So the gist is, if the objective goes down, let's say the CIT was the main, it comes back to just uh, one team or the other has to be the last one standing. By technicality, oh, the wow. militia team has already won, but by round standards, it the winner is usually decided by which team gets killed. Gonzo guy just picked off another one that was across the river, and he is currently sitting at 11 kills. This man, this man right here. If he peeks over these rocks, he might get a whole three guys, four guys, possibly. Yeah, because no and one's looking back. No one's got their 360 swivel on. And the thing that the Russians aren't looking for or listening go, go, go. for is the sound of an AK. They hear that go off, and they think it's one of their own. It's whether or not Gonzo guy actually decides to push it. He... I'm guessing he thinks there's someone behind him. Oh, here he goes. Can he see anyone, though? He might see head, but he keeps pulling out his lat. lat. He really wants those lat kills. But I don't think he has a rocket. And the thing doesn't have a scope on it, so I'm not sure what he plans on doing. I don't know. He's lost his chance now. Russian forces going after Lagar. Oh no. No, it's so annoying. Ooh, oh, and Lagar. he's just got an SKS. A brilliant move going around the rock though. Oh, not brilliant enough. One Newton one thinking about going over. All right, that's one militia. Meanwhile, D-Leak goes down as well. And Clay J went down, so we are just down to Gonzo guy. Oh, man. And he still got his lat out. All right, looking good. A squad one. We should the see these guys here. crossing, the and the oh, down goes up, Silver. Man. Gonzo guy is just destroying it with this uh, lat. Downside is he just gave himself away. Hey, squad, do you need idea where that rocket came from that just smoked one? Yeah, it sounded like it came from behind us. Okay, copy. Then, uh, be a little patient. Give it, like, 30 seconds or so. See if you can ID it. Solid. We're just holding here for now to see if anybody tries to cross this bridge. We've got nothing but gnats over here. Breaking. Spectator cameras. Spot him. Can't hit him though. I definitely don't think that's the only one because the rest of the Russians are just. They know the general the position. Forest. Yeah. They know the general position of him, Stu, but they don't know exactly where he is. Sticking his head out here, though, might be a dangerous thing. Yep. Hey, friendly squads, what do you got? I don't think we have enough command around to actually... We got infantry on top of Gulf 591. Take that back. Block, Block 16. One taps him. Oh, yeah. What a shot. He just called that over command, too. 
single uh, single KIA. I was just over his shoulder. That was a beautiful oh. shot. All right, that is GG for round two. Yeah, good work, guys. Oof.